Okay, this is it. No nicotine day one. Uh, all right. Look, I've been through this kind of thing before, but I like on, I'm, on this day, I have clarity. I've committed. My will is in the right place. It took a long time, well, at least a couple of weeks to work towards the decision to rewire my brain to not, you know, stick lozenges in my mouth or chew nicotine gum or that fucking snooze. The snooze is the thing that's killing me, I think. Like, how how long can you go on telling yourself that, like, well, I'm not going to be the one that gets sick. I'm not going to be the one that gets the cancer. I'm not, you know, I I hear it happens. I, I hear rumors that tobacco is bad for you, but I, I don't think it's going to be me. I mean, how long does that shit hold up? Anyways, so this is day one. I've got some clarity. I've got the energy. But right now, I'm not freaking out because I think it's excitement. I think I feel excited. And I'm not, I'm not freaking out though. It, did, it was, it was sort of a tough morning in the sense that usually I wake up and I just, I have coffee and I stick a really strong packet of snooze into my face and then I sit down and I enjoy it. So that's not happening right now, but I'm, I'm excited about it because I, I've, I've made a decision though the snooze is still in the fridge, but I don't want it. I don't want it. All right. All right. All right, day two, not so great. Fuck it, man. Like, okay, here's what's going on. Here's what's going on. D- d- day two is that all of a sudden, I don't... G- what difference does it make? And that's a question I'm asking about everything. All right, and I, didn't, I wasn't feeling that way yesterday or the day before when I was still doing shit. What difference does it make? Fuck it. See, that's, that's the sickness. That's the sickness is that my brain, because it's so hungry for its, for its, uh, for its, uh, uh, endorphin feeder, for its fucking food, for its nicotine is saying, dude, what difference does it make? Fuck it. Life is short. You know, die of mouth cancer. Life is short. What the fuck, man? Enjoy what you enjoy. Could end any second. Could end during this, this monologue. Could end during this nicotine diary, whatever the fuck. I could, it could be like, and then I fall and it's over and you will have not had uh, a nicotine in your mouth, a snooze or a, or a a nicotine lozenge. Oh, okay. Fuck it, man. I don't know if I'm going to make it. God damn it. How can I be feeling this way on day two? God damn it. I got to throw that shit away that's in the fridge. Oh, man. Oh! Fuck! Day three. I can't, everything is fucking bothering me. I feel bad for people who have to pretend all the time that they're keeping their shit together, that they like who they're working with or that they're okay at home or that, like, you know, when you drop something on the ground that you didn't want to drop, it isn't the end of the fucking world. Because in my life right now, it is. It's making me nuts. It's like my my entire body just is like wants to blast off or blast apart, kind of explode into particles and regroup, regroup around a piece of nicotine something. It wants to regroup. Every every cell in my body wants to regroup around nicotine. Around nicotine, I'm denying it. That I can feel the hunger in every cell of my fucking body right now. Every cell is just sort of like, dude, dude, dude. What's up? What's up? Where are we at with this? Where are we at with this? every cell of every organ of every vein of every blood thing of every 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 bone cell? Every fucking cell with every strand of DNA in my body is like, where are we at with this? Where, where are we at with this? What are we doing? What's going on? Come on, I want out. I want out. I'm feeling a little antsy. All my cells are antsy. They're all antsy. Oh, shit. God damn it. Holy shit. God, this craving is ridiculous. Day four, I want to die. I'm fucking losing it. I don't know. Time is, is, uh, doesn't seem to make sense. Emotions are, doesn't seem to make sense. I had an active argument with my penis today. Oh, fuck. 
Look at the size of that spider on the wall. It better be there or else I'm withdrawing much harder than I thought. I'm on the fucking garage. It's 11. Oh, man, I can't take this shit. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Why am I not doing this? Why does it have to be bad for me? Why can't... Why can't I just inject this shit? The only reason I'm not doing nicotine is because I don't want my mouth to turn into a fucking sewer of cancer and pus. Fucking snooze. I, it can't be good. And I think the nicotine gum and the last one just fucked up my gums. I would so be on it right now. I already feel myself. I just put on 13 pounds sitting here. And I'm fucking going out of my mind. I can't manage my brain. I did some comedy, but I was very erratic and raw and fucked up. I just don't like, I feel myself trying to talk myself into just doing the nicotine, but it doesn't make me feel good. Why not do the patch? Just to maintain. But why do I need something to maintain? At some point, my levels have got to fucking... <sighs> I've got to level off. This is the fourth day in. I'm drinking a lot of coffee. I'm doing anything I can to make myself feel better. But this is bad. It's bad. I've got a whole tin of snooze just sitting in the fucking fridge. I could just put one in my mouth and end this misery to enter a new misery or the old misery. Why don't I just smoke cigarettes? I don't. Th this is uncomfortable, man. I'm not sure that my baseline is good. Like, I'm not sure that, like, get rid of everything that I'm fucking, you know. I'm not, uh, I might not be cut out for this shit. This not being medicated somehow. I mean, I've been sober a long time, but this is clearly a mind fucker, this one. I mean, I'm not, you know, I'm not sweating or, but I'm pretty, I'm pretty crazy. I just always feel like, how about now? Can we do a little now? How about now? What about now? Can we have some? How about now? We just did the podcasting. Come on, can we have a little, well, just to have a gum or something. Come on, we just ate. Come on, dude. We just ate. Can we have a little? Come on, man. That's what my that's what my uh, my monkey sounds like. Dude, 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 dude. Come on, just a t just a little bit. Come on, let's have a little. Come on, man. It'll relax us. Come on, let's have a little. Come on, just have one. It'll be good. Not well. You, uh, you can have a, f a few, but you know, just don't go crazy, right? Don't go crazy. Maybe one a day. One a day. I've never had anything for one a day. I hear drumming in the distance. Do you guys hear that? I have drumming in the distance. Are my levels okay? Am I not talking loud enough? See, I can't even talk like I used to. I mean, I'm fluctuating. Everything's fluctuating with this no nicotine shit. Oh my God. And I'm going to fucking eat some ice cream. I'm just going to... And I'm, I'm having sex a lot. But that won't fill the hole. Nothing's going to fill the hole except for the hole itself. Nothing's going to fill the hole except the hole itself. Fuck you, Buddha. Fuck you. And fuck this shit. I should just... I'm going to go have some snooze. Don't do it. Come on, dude. Just a taste. You can just have a little bit. You can just have one, really. Just have one. Shut up. Shut it. Oh, God.